Hey guys, Officer Hillary here, back again at Six Flags Great Adventure. And we're meeting up with Jason tonight, and we're gonna check out some rides and eat some food. <laughs> you know, the usual stuff. Here it is, the grand reveal. The world's tallest roller coaster. That has to be one of the best entrances into any theme park. Also, for this season, if you cruise off here to the left, into this lane, the speed bump is a lot smoother than the other lanes. So you can cruise over it going like 30, 30 miles an hour or faster. You probably shouldn't though, because uh, security likes to sit up here in this little area on the side sometimes. So maybe not go that fast. But we're here and the park closes in an hour and 15 minutes. Despite the cold, unseasonable weather, El Toro seems to be hauling ass. It's about 50 degrees outside right now. It's uh, really cold. Oh, the seagulls are back. Oh my God, there's so many of them. What the hell? Look at this. And they just scavenge for food and left over in the parking lot from people. That's ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna head inside the park. We're gonna grab some food first because a lot of the food places outside the main entrance area Seem to close about an hour or so before the park closes, so we, we don't have much time. Um, what? Never seen that before. What the hell? <laughs> there goes Superman. Whee! The park is really, really empty right now. There's nobody in the parking lot. What's up? It's New Jersey Coasters. Um, so Jason, what's uh, what's up? I don't know. Uh, Are you a maintenance guy here? No. You look like a maintenance guy because of your hat. Uh, it looks like you're gonna fix the parachutes. Right? Uh, Jason just pointed out the Skyway bucket over here is actually from Six Flags Over Georgia because they closed their sky uh, sky ride attraction a couple of seasons ago and we acquired a lot of their buckets. You can tell because it has. Uh, new paint on it it doesn't have an m&m logo on the on the door there's ryan um he's i don't think he sees us let's walk fast new family restaurant uh, i almost called it family restaurants family restaurant. Family restaurant. <laughs> don't eat the urinal cakes it's not a restaurant <laughs> it's restrooms <laughs> Yo, it's on children. what <laughs> um <laughs> i wonder where reese is last time we were here he was working the big wheel he was literally operating it he could be anywhere he like he's trained at all the lakefront rides and the dark unido we got here like right when they closed up Fat Burger. I'm so mad. But Jason was able to grab burritos right before they closed. Look at how much they gave you. That's ridiculous. <laughs> she was pulling back like the card reader. And I'm like, can you stay over for one minute? She was like, all right. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah, she was getting ready to close. Then probably like seal up all the burritos and stuff for the night. Yep. So Jason got like crap ton on there. Heck yeah. We're going to check Granny's here. Maybe possibly get something here. I don't know. We got to hunt around for food because I haven't had dinner yet. And I don't feel like oh. buying food outside the park. Dude, I don't know. It's uh, it's like right about an hour before park closing. We're about to get on the Dream Street cables to head over to the other side of the park. I got a bunch of food, Johnny Rockets, milkshake, chicken tenders and fries. Yeah, you this having fun? This played in every Disney movie. If you get on VHS or DVD from like 2003 to 2007, I remember. Jason, you got that Rita's like 20 minutes ago and you're like a third of the way through it. <laughs> He's like, what? You, you bothered me for this? <laughs> Sky Screamer, stop yelling! <laughs> it's not that scary, it's only 200 feet! <laughs> stop screaming, I'm the Sky Screamer where you're supposed to scream, <laughs> damn it. Shut up! Oh my god. <laughs> Jason, you're being way too enthusiastic. This park feels so dead right now, because it is. Literally everybody walking around works here. <laughs> I see somebody from Park Services over there. I see uh, another person from Park Services. Some rides people probably were all walking around down there. No, I'm just kidding. Right here. Yeah, <laughs> like Jason. Did you finish your freaking Rita's yet? Jesus. Oh, it's very close. Not even. You're like halfway done. Pew! Oh, look at the mine train. Dude, there's like two people on it.
Hello, hey. Montclair. Yeah. Hi, Zach. Jason's out here screaming while I'm in the bathroom. I'm like standing by one of the urinals in there and I could just hear him outside screaming. What, did you drink Pib today or something? Did you drink like- Just Rita's. Rita's? Rita's doesn't give you that type of energy. What the hell? <laughs> There's literally nobody even in the front row on that. Whoa, did you hear those brakes? Squeaky brakes. Squeaky, yeah. Also? But as you can see, we're about to go ride this since it has no line. Might as well. Jason wants to marathon it. I'm like, I don't know, man. I just had a I bunch of food. Ride once every row. Oh, uh, really? Possible in like 10 minutes, 15 minutes. That is not possible. With the way this ride stacks, that is not possible. I'm gonna do it. No, you're not. I'll be, I'll be over at El Toro. You have fun with that. Okay, well, let's <laughs> I definitely want to ride El Toro at least a few times. Dude, last time I rode El Toro, I got on it one time and it literally broke down, and it was the end of the day. So I only got on it once. I was making some questionable noises. Is that, dude, is there a freaking train ride around here somewhere? Is that Bizarro or Medusa? What the fuck? Making that weird squeaky sound. That sound like a freaking uh, train. <laughs> is that train totally, that train? Dude, I think that, I think that train's empty. <laughs> I know, I want to ride front, back, front, back. I like this guy's job. He's just like, <laughs> go back around. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> that guy's getting paid right now to stand in the middle of the line. <laughs> you know, using flash pass on this? I mean, nobody's nobody's here. <laughs> it's crazy how no one never will use flash pass. Man, look at this shot of El Toro's drop when there's no leaves on the trees. That's 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 a nice shot. But the fire is turned off. Um, kind of makes sense. There's nobody riding. Yeah. It's kind of half ass six six flags theming. <laughs> yeah. Oh wait, look. There's two people on that train. <laughs> We just came off Medusa twice in a row. Who cares? We're not coming back to it. Why does it matter? Jason. Oh, <laughs> that's not necessary. We rode Medusa in the front and in the back. It was really good. A little bit whippier toward the back. It's much smoother this season, we noticed. Also, they had the fire effect turned off both rides. And then right when we got our stuff from the locker just now, they turned the fire effect on for that train. Like, what the hell? Didn't you want fire? Yes. Fire next time, hopefully. Suck my life. <laughs> Jason. <laughs> the runaway mine train sending empties. And you can still get ejector every time, even when it's empty. That's crazy. We got to get a locker here. The park closes in like less than 10 minutes. So hopefully we get more than one ride on this, because that'd be nice. We get two rides on Medusa, two rides on El Toro. That'd be awesome. One train, so... One train, ups. Oops, uh, it's kind of a dead meme now. Oops. Hopefully Logan doesn't watch this, he would kill me. Oh, he'd kill me. No, yeah, he would really kill you. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys in a few. Hey, we ran into James, it's Coaster hey, Complex. Hey, what's up guys? Go, yeah. follow, go follow Coaster Complex on Instagram. So it's kind of cold out tonight. El Toro isn't able to send trains out of the station unless the first three cars are filled, right? Is it the first three or two. first two? It's the first two, yeah. First two cars? So. There was like three empty seats on the train just now, right before closing, and they closed off the line, so nobody else was coming up into the station. And so people in the station had to go and ride to send the train out. And so a few people volunteered, they ended up getting a security guard. So I was like taunting the security guard, because usually at this ride, you're not allowed to have anything in the line with you, no phones, keys, or wallet. Yeah, and the security guard had his phone and a camera on his shirt and everything. I'm like, record a POV, put it on YouTube. And then, yeah, I was just like making fun of him and stuff. No loose articles. But yeah, he ended up riding with us, the security guard. And then a couple of other, uh, Jason's friend ended up riding too with us. Yeah. Uh, one of the team members up there. It was really fun. It was really funny uh, just seeing team members on the ride with us. But yeah, that was definitely a good last ride of the night. Is it, isn't he acting so strange? Definitely, definitely. <laughs> he's acting like Sean he's acting like 2017 Jason. Like <laughs> after after he ate, after he drank too much soda. Right was he gonna oh. scream? Be enthusiastic? Yo, I, I don't know. know. <laughs> he was he was screaming at people on the skyscreamer earlier. Really. <laughs> no, you didn't. We were. On was like, I'm not crying, but I'm scared. <laughs> That's a really funny moment, Jason. If I could find a clip from that, I'm putting it in the video. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not crying. I'm scared. 
Yeah. No, you said I'm not scared. I'm just something. I forget. No, I said I said it right. You're just an idiot. <laughs> I don't know. It was like five years ago now. You were like you were like you were like 13 when you were. That was your first ride on the Sky Screamer. Summer vibe. On the Orlando Starflyer now. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah, Jason, what do you think about riding the 400 foot ones? I ride those. Those ones like the swings twist because they're not know, connected I'm to... I'm not going to do that. Oh, yeah. They're, 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 they're much scarier. Sketchy. It is super sketchy. Like, like that, that <laughs> doesn't scare me. Yeah. yeah that, that's just sketchy. You don't ride the 400 foot ones? Oh, no, that's no he doesn't ride those ones. That's I've sketchy. I've rode New England Skyscraper backwards. Yeah, you can totally... That is sketchy. You can you make, make the whole swings. has died on one of those doing maintenance? Yeah. No, thank you. That's yeah. different. They wasn't strapped into the seat. He fell off of the tower. Yeah. Still scared. Wow. Okay. This video is going to be longer than I expected because we're just like doing this. <laughs> Jason, I found a shirt for you. Coaster queen. <laughs> I got new t-shirts here. Jersey Devil coaster with inverted colors. Purple. I think it's kind of cool. It's unique. I have this one over here. Oh, if we have, oh, we stopped in there and got um, some snacks because everything else was closed. And we still had the dining plan on our memberships. We're getting ready to head out for the night. We got on Medusa twice and we got on El Toro twice. I mean, that's pretty much all you can ask for for a good day. A yeah, good park doesn't really need much more than that. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll definitely come back here soon. All right, we're going to say goodbye, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace out. Bye. Peace out. Stops yelling! <laughs> it's not that scary, it's only 200 feet! Stop screaming, I'm the sky screamer where you're supposed to scream, <laughs> damn it! Shut up! Oh my god. <laughs> Jason, you're being way too enthusiastic. <laughs>